we're talking people that uh, are looking into logistics vans and stuff like that. How is Derek Automotive moving into that sector? Well, I mean, now convenience has a price on it when mm -hmm. you talk about like logistics businesses. Right. So, I mean, you already have too many packages to deliver in too short a period of time. Right. Uh, and what point in a logistic manager's schedule does he have even 10 minutes to recharge a van, let alone four hours? And what people don't realize is, you know, you have these new companies like Arrival and Rivian, all great companies. Uh, they have great technology. But they have to use these huge batteries to try to get, you know, two or 300 miles uh, of service range. And the bigger the battery, the longer the charge. Mm -hmm. So at some point, you have to stop and charge that van. Mm -hmm. And it's just time consuming. And if you think you're going to do it overnight, I tell people, call up your local power company. Because if you have more than a few vans, you're probably going to need a substation. So in addition to purchasing your van, you need to plan some type of additional power supply. So it's gonna be expensive. I think people, the whole story on electric logistics vans haven't been told yet, but I think we're gonna arrive just in time to be the hero in the story. That so sounds, that sounds that's awesome. That's our plan, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah.